Well, today is the 37th year that many all over the world are celebrating National Girls and Women in Sports Day. Today marks a day not only to celebrate the role that women play in the sports community, but more importantly to celebrate the pioneers who paved the way for many women like myself to have opportunities in sports and to be able to have a career in it. KLBK sports reporter Faith Douglas has more on what today means to many here in the 806. Well, it's always so great to be able to celebrate um, women in sports. and. Former Lady Raider basketball coach Marcia Sharp celebrated National Girls and Women's in Sports Day with Lady Raiders of all generations, but particularly the national champions of 1993. Another former Lady Raider that joined in on that celebration, Kayleen Cottle, who ran for Texas Tech's first women's cross-country team and played basketball as well, is more honored to have been a high school coach here in Lubbock of women's athletics for 34 years. I was very blessed to be at Estacada. I, I was just, I knew in ninth grade in high school what I wanted to do, and I knew as a freshman at Tech where I wanted to do it. And I just was very blessed to be able to do that and stay there my entire career. Another Lubbock coach who's been around women in sports for the last 20 years started his coaching career as a high school men's basketball coach. I think what's been fun is to see uh, just the relational part of the game. It's so much more important. And just the, the toughness of women. I mean, honestly, after all these years, they're just a lot tougher. Just been a joy. There's so much in the team, and there's so much. Uh, females are so much more unselfish. I think they're more into uh, the team, into each other, than they are into themselves. National Girls and Women in Sports Day is not only special to those playing sports now, but it's also special to those that helped pave the way, like legendary Marsha Sharp. I think it's really important that uh, that younger uh, women understand uh, the history of what got them where they are and the opportunities that they have today didn't just happen, mm -hmm. that there were a lot of people before them that paid prices to make um, opportunities for women equal across this country. With your KLBK Sports Connection, I'm Faith Douglas. Thanks so much, Faith. That's it for sports. More KLBK news coming up after the break.